I'm the Dollar Sportsman. Thank you guys for joining today. This beautiful afternoon, we have got the Brocock Sniper Magnum XR right here. We're gonna be siding it in today with an MTC King Cobra scope. I'm really excited about this. It's gonna be my competition rifle. I'm glad you guys came along, so keep watching. All right, guys, we've got our target set up at 50 yards. I have very small targets for aim small, miss small, right? This I'm really excited about. Um, thank you, Air Guns of Arizona, for sponsoring this for competition. The Brocock Sniper Magnum is a beast, it really is. Uh, this is actually one that I requested because I knew that this would be range ready and competition ready. The XR, put the side lever onto this. It's got adjustable power levels. You can see it's got the Huma regulator, which is specific to uh, Daystate and Brocock. They've got the side uh, pressure gauge, which I really appreciate, so I'm not looking at the end of the barrel. It's just amazing. This carbon fiber uh, bottle here at the end is huge. It holds plenty of air, uh, 0.48 liters. I mean, it's... It's ginormous, guys. <laughs> the fact that this uh, Lothar Walther barrel is uh, stock with this, everything is stock, guys. It's stock, adjustable stock, by the way. I'm just so excited to do this. Uh, the trigger's fully adjustable. It is, is really good anyway. I was out using this uh, a week ago, and we didn't even sight it in. We were just shooting at 25 yards with some friends. I couldn't film it because the wind was just nuts. But even in that wind, it still worked. It was amazing. So I'm gonna get it sighted in and ready to go. Then we're just gonna have a little bit of fun shooting it and see what we can do. And I will show you the groups right after this. All right, for the purpose of signing in today, we're using the 33.95 grain JSBs. Uh, sorry, that whole thing is ripped off, but that's all right. These things are monsters and they are huge, but very accurate with this gun. I'm gonna start off with the single tray, the single loading tray, and then I'm doing, gonna do a comparison as to the accuracy when we use the uh, rotary magazine right after that. So let's see how we do after we get sighted in. I'm curious to see, well, will a single tray really make that much of a difference against rotary magazine, or will it not? Let's find out. Okay, the accuracy on the single loading tray was absolutely phenomenal. Wow, I'm impressed. I mean, I wasn't even trying that hard to keep it accurate on the 50 yard. I had my cider down there at the bottom and it was just hole over hole. The one on the top, I, I was just holding it loosely. I mean, with this thing on, it's even harder. I had to mess with my, uh, my parallax to get the camera to work right so it's to my disadvantage and it still created a one inch group. That's amazing. All right, now let's try the magazine. We'll remove the one inch tray or the single loading tray and then we'll try five shots with the magazine and see how we do. All right, here we go. And for our top there. Wow. All right. Wow. Amazing. Oh man. <laughs> I'm excited guys. I'm excited. Brococked Sniper Magnum XR. 
chicken. Let's see, that's 44 yards. There we go. There we go. Woo! All right, guys, this was my cider. 50 yards using the single shot tray, hole over hole, three shots right there. Uh, I pulled it up from the bottom up and then over, three shots. And then this was the single shot tray, uh, trying to use the Tacticam, which I wasn't even trying that hard. And you still have a one inch group right there. I bet you I can still get hole over hole if I really put my more effort into it and time. And then here, five shots again, I think I can do better than that with the uh, the magazine, so I'm going to try it. Then I had this group right here. Uh, we do have wind gusts out here, but that shouldn't affect it too much. I had four shot group right there, and then I pulled that one, and that was just as the regulator was starting to let off. You can see that it's a little lower than the other groups. And then we just had fun with it. Just shot at 50 yards, little teeny tiny targets, and uh, I'm shooting exactly where the reticle is pointing. I'm excited. This, this is fun. Uh, I think we're going to take just a few more shots for the fun of it, use up the rest of the targets, and uh, see how precise we can get. Okay, right here, We've got our bullseye, and then the other four shots were all in this teeny tiny quarter inch hole right here. That was the single shot tray. And then this was the magazine. One, two, three, four, half an inch group. And then I pulled one. I messed that up by pulling one, one. Otherwise it was a half inch group. So quarter inch, half inch. There is a difference between the single shot tray and the magazine, but not by much, guys. Not by much. So I ran into Jared with Air Guns of Arizona out here. You should check out that channel. He does a lot of good reviews. He has reviewed these Brokaw guns. What do you think of these? What's your favorite part of it? I'm a big fan. I mean, obviously the side lever, because that's new, but it's not just the side lever, it's how smooth it is. It's very buttery, it's effortless. It just feels like it's rolling buttery. glass. It's so smooth in there. Everything about the side lever, they did it proper. I've always liked the compact size of the sniper here. It shoulders really well out in the field. It really gives you a, a semi-pup, as they call it, but the newest addition being the side lever just puts it over the top for me. Awesome, man. Hey, it's good to see you. Yeah, you too. <laughs> hey, guys, keep watching. We're having fun out here, dang it. You can too. You can do this. Get out there. You can see the innate accuracy of this thing. Oh man. Special thank you to Airguns of Arizona. I'm repping you to guys today. Uh, I'm ex really excited to get this out for the first NRL 22 match in a month. Uh, there's one on the 4th of July, but uh, I'm going to be with family that day, and I think you should too. But I hope that you get out, have some fun, have some shooting. You can do that with Airguns, and you can definitely be a sniper with the Brokock line of Airguns. You've seen me use the Concept Light, the great success. This thing is just absolutely phenomenal. I am so excited. I am the Dollar Sportsman. Thank you so much for watching, and we will see you very soon at competition. That's pretty comfortable. Let's give it a shot. Or two or sixty. We're in buck territory. Yes! <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> I'm the dollar sportsman. Yes, I'm the dollar sportsman. I'm the dollar sportsman. Having fun out here. And just enjoy all of this. Because after watching these videos, I hope you do. Yeah, buddy.